children learn from their environment, right? Particularly when they're pre-literate. So they're, they touch and they feel and they explore, they put things in their mouths. So they learn by their sensory exploration um, of the physical environment. And so it's a real source that's not usually tapped by people as a way of helping children learn. The goal of the study was to see if we could improve two childcare centers that I had studied in a previous study um, that were really lacking in play opportunities. And they were particularly lacking in uh, plant material, any natural elements were missing. And they also didn't have a lot of challenge in what we call risky play. And, you know, I've been doing videotapes of children in outdoor play spaces for 20 years. And I'd never seen this amount of sort of boredom and just kind of dazed look. So we had one boy in one center who would just stand there as the whole world went around him. And this was his time to go outdoor play. And um, that was very um, disquieting. And we had another boy in another center who would just pace back and forth along the fence, almost like you see animals do if their, their cages are too small. A lot of centers can't afford to redesign entire play space. But we added potted bamboo and we bought in pots of um, like ornamental grass. You see it a lot, very popular now, but they, they change a lot in scale very rapidly so the children notice the, the plants growing. So we put that in. We also put in what's called sort of risky play elements, things like bricks um, and poles and things that kids can manipulate. And both these children, once we installed the plant material and the risky play elements, they changed. Actually, the little boy started riding his bike and started discovering that he could ride his bike all over, his tricycle all over the play space because we designed paths for the child to actually move around. And the other boys started interacting with the plant material and interacting with the other kids. So they both became more socially engaged with their peers, which is exactly what we want to see at this age.